one suggestion for you, one thing you could do is if there's a game that you're totally lost on, you yeah. could look up an explanation for only the setup of the game, creating just the main diagram. Don't look at the rest of the explanation though. Don't look at the walkthroughs of the individual questions. Yeah. In that game. Just use a source like, like mine or others to get a diagram yeah. and yeah. then try it on your own. Exactly. I'll watch your YouTube videos and I'll just watch how you diagram it. And then I'll pause the video. I'll try to answer the questions based on the diagram. And then I'll go, I'll replay your video and see how you did it in, compar in comparison to how I did it. And believe it or not, sometimes I'll do it differently than you, but I'll still get the right answer. So that's how I know that I can't always apply this formula to this because everybody does things differently. You know, there's more than one way to get the right answer. Totally. And that speaks to what we were discussing earlier, how if you can solve it efficiently, that's fine. And honestly, I've solved the same exact game a few different ways on different attempts. Like I might do the same game a year or two apart and I'll solve it a different way each time and no way is right or wrong. It's just somewhat arbitrary in that moment, the direction I took. Thanks for tuning into the show. Please subscribe if you haven't done so already to be notified of new episodes as I release them. And feel free to reach out if you need anything at all as you move forward with your prep. I'm happy to help however I can. In the meantime, I wish you all the best and take care.